And I, one of the things that fascinates me about Paul is how human he was. You know, he's, he sometimes could speak so well, and sometimes he, he seemed to be halting. Sometimes he flew off the off the handle, he made some harsh statements like to the Galatians, you know, you might as well be mutilated. Or when he said to the Philippians, I feel like, and I think the translation of the old King James Bible was close to the ones we use now, I feel like a bunch of dung. <laughs> uh, uh, I mean, he was a man who had true true emotions and, and true frustrations and, and a tremendous uh, love of, of Christ and love of people. You know, another thing that I find is very strong in Paul that made, made an impact on me in my life to the point that when I was 25 years a priest, I chose that beginning of Romans 9 as the second reading for my Mass, when, when Paul said that he would gra- gladly be anathema for the sake of his, of his kindred according to the flesh, that he was willing to give up everything. Hmm? I mean, plain English, he was willing to go to hell if that would bring about the salvation of his fellow Israelites. That was a strong statement, but it sa- says something about a man who uh, was really committed and involved emotionally and totally hmm, in, in what he was doing. 